Not always easy. Not, not, not easy to control, no, I can understand that. You're going to go for a catch? Yes! <laughs> Skills. Thanks, Jürgen. Fantastic. Thank you. Too close, Jason, because you want to track it, but just a little bit. several hundred years ago. Mike managed to get some drawings of it, went online, did a load of research, found out everything he could, and then 
put pen to paper, engage brain and thought, how can I make a mechanism that would actually replicate the way this vessel works? So ladies and gentlemen, this is the beast. It was a steam-powered vessel. You can see we have smoke coming out of the funnel. I'm just going to let you admire it. Watch this. Very difficult to turn this round in a pool of this whip. So Mike has got his colleague has come with him to flee from side to side. So it is capable of turning, but we need to pull a little bit wider than this, so we're just going to give it a little bit of hand assistance. If it comes round nice and close to you, which it's going to do, just lean forward, study the mechanism, and figure out how on earth does that actually work. Wind in your hair. Okay. Okay, so here I am. Uh, I'm with Daniel Hall, right? Yes. And uh, we're at the Leipzig show. 
And uh, on Facebook yesterday, Daniel, saw a post about this amazing glider that you've got, powered glider. Yes. So could you tell me something about it? Uh, yeah. Um, this is uh, Ita from, uh, uh, from me. I have built this with uh, a mold. Uh, this is uh, 3D printed. And uh, with vacuum farming, uh, make I this, uh, this little glider. This is powered uh, by uh, two uh, four millimeters. Uh, tiny. Engine. It's very tiny. Can Let me get it? up close and uh, focus on that. Amazing. Yes. And that actually pops. Pops it, out. It when pops I, out. When I give thrust, comes out. And when I uh, go backwards with thrust, he goes inside. Right. Okay. Yes. And this is the transmitter. I can open it. The transmitter is a Deltang. It's the receiver is what's yes, the? Yes, the receiver. Oh, okay, right. Yes, yeah. it's uh, uh, with uh, three uh, ESCs. I need all three ESCs for uh, thrust, elevator, and rudder. Okay. Now the servos aren't typical servos; they're linear actuators. Is that it's what you call actuators? Actuators. Uh, he works with uh, magnets, and um, it's the same thing uh, uh, with a motor EC. Um, I give a uh, uh, um, pull up. The servo becomes a little bit electric, strong, and uh, the elevator goes uh, upside or downside. Fantastic. Okay. And in terms of the airframe itself, this is, is this Depron? This is Depron, yes. But it's, it's molded? It's molded with, uh, with vacuum and heat. And uh, okay. with a vacuum uh, desk, we can uh, make uh, this uh, beautiful gliders. It's one of the uh, one of more gliders when we make. So how thin is that that Depron? It looks this, like it's, uh, it's uh, 0 0.2 millimeters or 0 0.5 millimeters. Super thin. Super thin. Super light. Super light. It's uh, 10 grams. Amazing. Fantastic. Thanks very much for uh, showing me that. No problem. <laughs> this <is a> battery. <laughs> That's the battery. This is a battery. <laughs> okay. So Daniel's kindly going to give us a quick flying demonstration. And the glider itself is modelled on what? Uh, the full the full size glider, yes. Yes, it's a uh, it's Itar. 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 Okay. So Gernot Bruckmann has uh, the same glider with uh, fifteen point six meters. Right. It's, uh, this is a smaller version. This is a smaller version. <laughs> yes. It's a Sahal from his elevator, <laughs> from the span. Yeah. <laughs> Gernot's Itar. I mean his two meters uh, elevator span. And this is uh, one meter, this is the half. <laughs> <Yeah>. Okay. <laughs> Great, okay, so let's uh, watch it fly. So maybe you could show me just that, that motor and how it pops up. If I, uh, could I hold it and then... Uh, yes. Very delicately. Right, okay. Would you like me to launch for you? Uh, or off the floor? On the floor. Okay. Hold on. Here we go. Is there any chance of catching a thermal in here, Daniel? I don't think so. <laughs> that is amazing.